Hey guys, it's Intrep Gamer, and you guys are wondering, you know, why no Civilization 6 videos today? Well, I'll tell you why. I'm actually spending a lot of time playing Mass Effect Andromeda, hence this video for you guys to enjoy. I'm actually doing a lot more videos right now for this series on GS for Gaming. You can catch me there. This is an, to be fair, Intrep Gamer's channel is more of a spin off series. To kind of refine video and editing techniques so to, you know kind of talk through this too i'm having a lot of fun playing mass effect and drama the multiplayer is definitely the highlight of playing the game you know it's just a little tedious because some of the players are not good but you know it kind of is what it is i'm definitely not good i'm still learning my player character and I don't really have a lot of gear right now weapons wise so kind of have to use it what you got and right now mostly for me is using a lot of biotic abilities and I mean Vanguard is a lot of fun. I played Vanguard in pretty much all the Mass Effect games beforehand and I kind of my first love is Vanguard so pretty much you know a lot of this is me running around using my abilities and stuff kind of just you know whooshing in and Trying to get some cool kills and stuff, so I'll let you guys enjoy this video playthrough. I'm not gonna really talk through most of it. I'll, you know, put in some cool stuff here and there, you know, and you know, I, I'll lie. I'm gonna try to keep you guys entertained as much as I can. So this game, definitely a lot of fun. And I mean, look at that. Look at that combo use right there. Just in, explosions, boom. So, this is actually me doing a post commentary video for Mass Effect. And, you know, I just didn't really want to talk at the time. So, I just wanted to play and have fun. And, I mean, it's, it's a lot of fun. I think I died maybe once. But, you know, you got to use it what you got. And I'm doing the best I can. Like, you know, boom, 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 stuff like that. I'm also trying to try out some new key binding moves that I have because for me like some of my moves for doing the single player just trying to use three is very clunky I'm actually thinking maybe I can try to try with a controller I have a PlayStation 4 controller that I can theoretically use to do better on but at the same time you know it's just a uh, mouse and keyboard man I gotta do that PC elite stuff you know Anyways, this is definitely a fun game. I recommend getting it just for the multiplayer because it is a lot of fun. But it's definitely something you're not meant to play for super long grinding hours. It's just, you know, like, there's only so much you can recycle. And it's pretty annoying to try to play with people because some people, as I said earlier, are not very good. Your host being one of them, you know. But I am... Um, Trying to learn, trying to run around, do a lot of gun toting with my shotgun, and just, you know, bam, bam, two shots to the chest. Definitely want to try to get more powerful moves so that we can charge in and just wreck people and just, you know, be a general badass all the while. But, yeah, you know, just doing what we have to do, trying to stay alive. It's kind of cool, you know, we're playing, uh, I think. This put like once in the sorry, one is the Agari, Agara, I believe that's what they called, and I think the other one is a Turian teammate. So look at me just rolling in. Lee Boy Jenkins would be so proud right now. Look at that, just melee with that biotic attack. Just come on, take that face. Boom! Look at that. I really do like the charge ability. My actually spec. If I'll tell you guys right now, is to kind of go for mostly a more chargey effect so that I can just rush into the target, do a slam, and then just shotgun everyone and melee everyone to the base. But we'll see how it is, you know, try to do all that, figuring out the play style. And it's kind of cool that you get two of every character, at least in the beginning, so you can be like, well... Try this spec first, try this other spec first, so you can get a taste of how each of the uh, specific class you're doing. So like the Vanguard, when you go for a charge, you can go for one that does more of a shock value or something that does more of like a 
area of effect value. I, I still don't really know what it is. I'm going for the more shock soldier kind of thing. Because I'm like, you know what? Like, just charge right on in and just bam, bam, bam. Right in the face, you know. Shotgun shells. As soon as I get machine pistols, I think I'll just whip that one out too. And just hit everyone in the face. Trying to be close range. But assault rifle is a pretty good weapon too, you know. Um, I, the only thing I really didn't like is I had a scope. And I had a scope on for a while. And it's, it's, it's different, you know. It's definitely different from how playing with a shotgun or having just a regular assault rifle with no scopes. So... Uh, you know, but we're trying to figure out how to do a lot of stuff. I'm trying to survive, and I think... Do I die? No, I think I survive right here. Like, just barely. Yeah, it's... And I, oh, for you guys, if you're wondering, I'm playing this on bronze, so this is... This is the most sadder when I die in this, but... You know, I kind of went a little bit too crazy, balls deep. Definitely need to get something that can deal with shielding, I believe. Because shielding, not a lot of people have armor, but a lot of enemies have shields. At least some bronze level. Maybe we'll see how, you know, silver or gold would be like. But definitely, it's definitely fun. You know, I'm enjoying this. The multiplayer is definitely fun. Single player that I've been playing so far has been interesting. Uh, definitely I understand what people mean about the animations, you know, stuff like that, because I started to notice certain points of the game where, like, oh, you know, something looks a little wonky or a little crooked and just doesn't look as smooth as it can be, you know. I played Mass Effect 3 very recently, a couple months ago, and that was definitely very smooth done. But, you know, it, it, it is a different time. And I guess maybe they have pressure from corporate. I think, yep, that's me putting, getting put down. But I got picked. Ooh, wait. No, okay. All right, back up. Now it's time to just go insane on that membrane, that mech unit right there. So, definitely if I go for anti-armor, I'm definitely taking on, like, the big guys. But if I have a good team, it shouldn't be that much of an issue. So I'm thinking... You know, deal with the masses of units, and that's all shielding. And I, I don't know if I die here, too. I think I survived. Go about this check out, though. Look at me. Ooh. Ooh. Left to play. Made it. Made it. Yeah. Ooh. Dang. Charge it in. Someone's got biotic abilities. Someone's got a biotic shield. Kind of have to jump out. Oh, dang. I think I'm going to die again. Oh, I'm on fire. Oh, oh and dang, I suck. See, like I said, I am definitely not the best uh, player in the game. I kind of just like to have fun, roll in. I do like being ballsy, though. So, like, this is me being ballsy, trying to get in to rescue our teammate. I thought he was over to the left, but lucky for him, you know, we killed them all before. I got to it, got some extra points, so, you know, but it's fun, it's definitely a lot of fun, I'm definitely having a blast playing this game, and here we go, getting into the extraction zone, trying to, yeah, see, it's just that, that scope is definitely annoying, it's nice to have it to be pick off, but then you miss most of your shots at extreme range anyways, so, if I get an assault rifle that's definitely like a rifle more than an assault rifle well, you know probably do a lot better so here we go trying to oh the guy got himself up yeah i was thinking if i was going to like dodge in try to like be heck of you know smooth and try to kill him this definitely was crazy this is just they all just came in through that one room and it's just like yo man I gotta try to put them down oh that was pretty badass right there actually if i do say so myself and boom, cool. I think about a minute left for the extraction. Oh man, that was a lot. I think yeah, this is where I kind of freaked out a little bit. I was like, oh come on, team, we gotta get, we gotta get to the uh, extraction zone. And I was like, oh snap, we gotta, we gotta dodge out all these crazy guys right now, you know. So let's try to take out this guy. I think. Oh yeah, got him right in the face. 
my life. This is me just saying, you know what, screw it. Trying to get out of here. Just pop that guy in the face. And yeah, you know, this is pretty much it. I'm going to try to get my buddy up. And do I succeed? I do succeed. All right. Well, this is like, what, 20, 25 seconds left. Got to try to keep as much, try to keep us all alive, you know. Definitely getting swarmed and, like just, you know, yeah, see, look, if you shoot from extreme distance, most of these bullets kind of like shift to the left and right just because the extreme range is not so ideal. But we got about five seconds left and survival. So I guess this would be my point to say, hey, Thanks for checking this video out. Please like, comment, favor, and subscribe. Like I said, we're doing more videos over at G's for Gaming, so you should check that shit out. And I'll see you guys next time.